Today we are going to try out the Today we are going to test out this Winter Beauty Winter so Winter so Beauty <laughs> the Today we are going to t <laughs> Okay hold on. Hello everyone how are you doing today Today we are going to test out this Huda Beauty Winter Solstice Lip Strobe Mini Collection and then we are going to try and see if we can find some dupes, some really, really cheap dupes. So this is what the Winter Solstice collection looks like. It comes with four mini lip glosses with 2 ml of product in each and at Sephora it retails for $33 plus tax. I have to say plus tax because I do live in California and it's quite a bit. You get four different shades in here. There is a goldeny shade. This is the fluorescent blue shade, a crimson shade, and the fluorescent kind of pink or fuchsia shade. These are pretty comfortable to wear. They're not sticky at all. So here are the four shades. You have a golden, a kind of iridescent or almost fluorescent blue and iridescent crimson I would call it and a fuchsia pink and that too feels a little bit fluorescent here actually all of them except the golden one in person look very fluorescent but on my lips I felt like the blue one and the fuchsia one had the most impact now for dupes, I have a few different options. First of all, I have two lip plumpers from Ulta Beauty. These retail for $12 each, but Ulta pretty much has some sale or another going on very, very regularly. You can always find them, buy one, get one half off, buy one, get one free, or like buy two, get two free. So there are only two shades in this particular product. Here are the swatches. And on top, we have the Huda Beauty lip glosses. On my lips, I have the golden crimson one on one side, whereas kind of the pink fuchsia one on another. And that way you could see both and I have to take it off only once. But I feel like in person, these have more impact. However, these are plumping glosses, so they do make your lips kind of tingle or burn, you know, a little bit like you've eaten some spicy food. So if you don't like that, then you probably won't like these. So oh, it might have felt like a few seconds for you. For me, it's been about half an hour. My kids just came home with a pasta necklace, which he said we should cook later. Anyways, so these lip plumping glosses have been on my lip this whole time and they are still tingly. So the tingle doesn't go away. The next dupe I have is this Lip Artist 5 Lip Topper Collection by Jasmine LaBelle. And I purchased it for $8 from Ross and this is what the set looks like so in this case also we have three matches they are not exact in this case basically these are not as sheer but these are lip toppers and i think they will function fantastically we have the shade galaxy which looks very very similar to the bluish shade from huda beauty the glitter or shimmer in this feels a little bit more chunkier then you have rose gold on my lips it feels more gold than rose gold and i think these can be built up this one is aurora it has both pink and bluish shimmer on my hand i feel like it swatches like the fuchsia one from the huda kit whereas on my lips the blue reflect is more visible then you have two more colors opal and mystical mystical is more on kind of a pinker side and opal is kind of a light pink they're not really dupes for anything in the huda set but these are good to have and then I have one more set that I got from the discount store. This is the Paris Hilton Lip Wonderland set. You get four lipsticks and this was $5 at Marshalls. Now this particular set according to me had two possible matches. I thought the holographic would be similar to the crimson one but it was kind of making my lips feel a little bit hot and that was 
and no matter how much I tried to build it up there was nothing I mean I could see the pigmentation in the bottle but it wasn't translating to my lips at all and it wasn't translating on my hand either it just looks like a clear gloss on my hand the second product from this set that I thought had a potential of being a dupe was the Diamond Lust gloss. In the swatch itself, I could tell that it was chunkier and then on my lips, it has a bad, bad texture. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, it has that. I wonder if it'll dry matte. It might not be a gloss. Well, it doesn't say gloss. The other gloss in this set is this bronze color. And then you get a matte liquid lipstick so i'm gonna say yeah this is not this is a fail as a dupe okay i think i need to record this i think this is a matte lip color not a lip gloss because once it dries it doesn't have the sticky feeling so it's a matte diamond liquid lipstick it tastes like a weird sweet kind of a taste but yeah i think once it dries it's pretty it's pretty but it's not a dupe and the last possible dupe I have is this Leak Reflections Unicorn Iridescent Sparkle Lip Topper that I purchased from Kohl's. It retails for $12 and comes in this fancy case with a mirror similar to the nude sticks cases. It looks super pretty. It does say lip gloss anyways. But I think similar to the Paris Hilton Diamond whatever, this is a matte texture and it's designed to dry matte and it's pretty comfortable once it dries so you could possibly top off your matte liquid lipstick with this particular one but again whopping $12 you can always pretty much find coupons at Kohl's but it's not super cheap yeah so overall these were my possible dupes for the Huda Beauty liquid lipsticks I think I found quite a few like two each for the three colors however i haven't found a single dupe so far for the golden one which i thought should have been the simplest one more thing i should point out that is the huda lip glosses are made in italy the ulta beauty ones are made in canada whereas all the other things that i tried today are made in prc or china basically so that is something to keep in mind when you are playing with these i would kind of advise against the paris hilton set it didn't make me feel that great i like these plumping toppers um don't go for the usual i think it's they're called shimmery glosses which look very very slim similar i really don't like those but i like these particular ones the because they're not sticky and i actually really like this lip artist set including the packaging by jasmine labelle i think this is kind of the closest dupe and then some so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give this video a giant thumbs up let me know if you are planning to buy these huda beauty glosses or if you already have them and how you are liking them and what did you guys think of the dupes? If you have any other dupes, which I didn't mention here, do let me know so in the comments below. And thanks again for watching. Bye.